This channel's real, this channel's about documenting, this channel's about talking, having an open opinion. And let's get started. Say bro, say bro. Say bro, say bro. Head of a horse, the body of a man. Unidentified flying object. What's up guys, it's me Do Not Obey and let's get into another video. Now we're getting into the sky and we're talking about the city that was seen a long time ago in China and then ships that have been seen floating literally in the sky. Now, I'm going to say it, but I'll probably say it again. I don't believe that it is the scientific word. I forgot the name of the word. I'll try to throw it on here, but I don't believe it's that. Um... I'm going to show you guys like some pictures, some clips, and something out of the good book. So yeah, so just keep an open mind and everybody has been seeing these all around the world. Everything's got to be an illusion, but when are people going to start believing their own eyes? Even though they have eyes, they do not see. Even though they do have ears, they do not hear. Do not obey. Stay woke. Peace. surface out of China and it looks like their city is floating in the clouds. Of course, we can't verify if the video is real or not, but we have seen things like this before. This is a type of superior mirage called a Fata Morgana, where air temperature near the surface is actually cooler than the air above. It can make objects appear like they are stacked on top of each other, or in this case, like a city floating in the clouds. The same phenomenon happens when you're driving in your car on a hot day and you see what appears to be water or something liquid on the road in the distance or you've heard of people walking through the desert and they see water in the distance and then once you get closer it disappears light waves travel through the atmosphere from the sun straight to your eye but they actually travel through the atmosphere i'm just gonna say i don't believe that it, that it's that definition um yeah i mean it I, it could be possible i don't believe that because there's sightings that go back even in the Bible, which you're going to see after this out of Revelations. Um, I believe this could either be beings or our own government using Project Blue Beam or some type of ancient technology. But I, I, I'm sorry. They always have an answer for everything that they consider miracles or something that they cannot explain. And I'm tired of it. Like, it is what it is. We're seeing what we're seeing. And this world is fake as fuck at different speeds. A mirage occurs when the temperature on the ground is hotter than the air above. When light travels through the cooler air into that warmer air near the ground, the light is refracted or bent. And what your eye is seeing is not that U-shaped bend, but an illusion. It also makes you think about the demon face. Remember how now they're saying that if you see somebody's face distorted, it's not what you see. Do not believe your own eyes. Now, this is what you're seeing because this is the definition of it. But, pe man, let's continue with the video. Real quick, up next, this picture is allegedly uh, the four horsemen or some people riding horses in the sky. Now, this is an actual picture that was taken. It is alleged, but I figured I'll throw it in here because you know it goes with the good old book, the fact and fiction, fiction and fact book. So, yeah, let's continue.
A man in England snapped pictures at what appears to be a large ship floating above the water. The optical illusion was spotted off the coast in southern England. According to meteorologists, the illusion is called a superior mirage. It happens because of special atmospheric conditions that bend the light. Cold air sits right above the seawater with warmer air above it. The visual phenomenon is common in colder places like the Arctic, but I can see this, you know, scientifically I love science. Okay. But where's the ship? Where's the ship in the ocean that is supposed to make it the same picture up top? Because light reflects off of water as well, right? Hence why I believe rainbows is nothing but showing us there's a glass dome on top of the earth, but I don't know that. Mm. Has occasionally been seen in the UK during the winter.